to the heated debate over the shooting of a high school student in Nevada. He had a knife. Students were terrified all around him. The 14-year-old boy is seen on camera swinging that large knife, threatening classmates critically wounded by a school officer. ABC's Matt Gutman reports tonight there are growing questions. Did the officer have any other options? Kid. Tonight, as Reno police investigate a school resource officer's shooting of this knife-wielding teen... Bro, he just shot the kid. The 14-year-old's family is saying what you see here... Back up! ...wasn't a thwarted lone wolf attack, but a case of self-defense gone wrong. This should have been a situation that was obviously subject to control by non-lethal means. The family saying the 14-year-old was a troubled boy with special needs. You had a very mentally unhinged student attempting to keep people away from him by swinging knives in the air. His father posting on Facebook that his son was merely defending himself against bullies. As the boy slashes at the air, lunging at students, you can hear voices yell, back up. Seconds later, that officer fires. Today, the school superintendent commending the response. Those plans work flawlessly. That boy's lawyer saying he could lose a lung and suffer brain damage. Now, all day we've been asking the Reno Police Department whether that school resource officer had non-lethal means at his disposal. So far, David, no response. Matt Gutman, thank you.